we remind residents and communities to be prepared for the inevitable wildfires that will come this summer and into the fall when the dangerous Santa Ana winds return. 虽然今年冬季的暴雨加暴雪给原本干燥的加州带来水源，但随着气温升高，植被慢慢枯萎，野火恐怕在所难免。加州林业和消防局的数据显示，今年大大小小的野火已有一千六百多起。Peak season really starts towards the end of August, September, October. We've even had some huge fires in December. So traditionally, October on is when those Santa Anas have a potential to blow. 在加州消防资源有限的情况下，官方要求民众自行清理住宅范围内的杂草和植被。You are creating an area around your home that is free of vegetation. This is what is called as defensible space, and it allows your fire department to place firefighters between your home. And the approaching flames. Without this space, the fire will quickly spread through the brush vegetation to your home. In addition to brush clearance, you can harden your homes by using fire-resistant materials. Flying embers from wildfires can also destroy your homes for up to many, many miles away. 官方表示，自今年五月以来，洛杉矶县府已经对十万户住宅进行灌木丛检查，并对两千九百户未按照规定的住户开了罚单。目前检查工作已经完成百分之九十。消防员也建议民众在野火季来临前准备好救生包，知道贵重物品所在的位置，随时做好撤离的准备。以上是新唐人电视台记者张博元、陆克在洛杉矶的报道。